Bro, the freaking car part looks like a razor product. I mean, I mean it is razor, so. Yo guys, so behind me is one of the coolest office buildings in Singapore. It's from a company which you might not have heard of. They're a pretty small company, you know, indie company just starting out. They're called Razor and this is their office building. They're a pretty small company. So today we're going to be taking a tour in the office building and see how it looks like. So Razer actually invited me out into their building to tour around and do a vlog. Um, it's not actually a sponsored video guys, I just wanted to do it myself and uh, yeah, let's tour the building. Alright, so introductions. Hi, I'm Dexter. This is Dexter. <laughs> I'm Mark. Uh, this is Mark, the guy that communicated me in. Hi. And this is? I'm Anora. Anora. Hi, <laughs> nice to see you. She's an intern. <laughs> so after meeting the wonderful people that are giving me the tour, we gotta explore the Razor store on the first floor. This Razor store is actually open to the public and you can come over and try out their stuff. They even have their Razor chair and some new apparel which just came out. It's kind of weird. Razor told me a bit more about this place. This is their main HQ in Singapore. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> this screen right here you see, it's a 8K, I think one of the biggest screens there is. Yeah, like biggest 8K. 8K screen, LED screen that we have. Out there, yeah. Of course, because it's Razor, you know, they, they don't cheap out. <laughs> yeah, so, exactly. <laughs> so they're gonna bring me around today, the HQ building, and uh, let's explore. Yeah, let's get coffee. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> the next thing we gotta try out is the Razor Cafe, which is actually a robot as the barista. So there's no one actually manning the store, and the robot makes the coffee for you. Again, this is on the first floor, so it is open to the public, and you can come down and try it yourself. I'm not really a coffee guy, but the coffee was good. That's cute. After the coffee, I scanned my QR code to get private access to the second floor. This is the guest reception area, so you see like, you know, fancy black and green, as usual. <laughs> as usual. You see, all our awards on one side, just for the sea region, and like we have a lot of international ones as well. And then we have a lot of the top of line products that we display here. Oh. Then we have uh, another giant sticky thing. Hey. So, this is where we take our employee photos. So oh! Later you can come and cross your arm to an esports post. Let's go! Esports post. <laughs> Dude, this is crazy. This is like some sort of podcast. Like, hey guys, welcome back to my podcast. This is just a waiting area, by the way. It's kind of crazy. So, yes. you see a lot of meeting rooms here. Oh, wait. Is anyone using that? Let's show you Sam. Oh! Now we enter the massive meeting room, also codenamed the Boom Slang. A very funny name. I just found out it was the name of a snake. Also, fun fact I just found out that all Razor products are actually named after species of snakes. Oh, damn, guys, this is. I'll work somewhere like this. So we have meetings over here. We have, uh, yeah, even even the screen is huge, right? Like nine, yeah. nine TVs to make one big screen. And we have this like system on the ceiling that like wherever you sit and talk, right, people they will just capture your voice. Like, oh. Quite, quite, I was like, how do you hear me? I was like sitting over there. Wait, does it work like now? No, 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 no. Like, if no. you have a meeting going ah. on, right? You know the meeting room, you add it to the to the call and stuff, right? You enable it. None of you need to connect a mic or anything. You just That's like, see wherever so you cool. just schedule. So it's like it's like live Discord. Yeah, with just yeah. like because it's, it's way too far away. The camera will focus on you. Oh. You will identify that you're the one speaking. Yeah. And you will zoom in. It actually knows where the yeah, voice is coming from. Now, yeah. Oh it is? Yeah, yeah, yeah it's trying to like find us. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. Whoa! Yo, I'm, I'm the one talking, look at me. <laughs> now with that much technology in a room, you'd probably think they only hold the most important meetings here. Do you guys want to play Among Us? Yeah, sure. Exploring the rest of the second floor, we come to the pantry. And oh boy, Razer has a really cool pantry. The most unRazer thing you'll see today. Like, this <laughs> wet floor. And to top off the pantry, it comes with a depression corner. So they're showing me the depressing corner. Maybe depressing area. Anti depressant. <laughs> yeah. Therapy garden. Therapy garden, yeah. yeah Therapy garden. Probably. Now the garden is spectacular, but we wanted to see more of the building. So we headed to level 3 and well, there was another pantry, so. Level 3 mainly consists of their offices and meeting rooms, so we didn't get to see much of those because it was a Friday afternoon and everyone's working. So instead, we headed up to the fourth floor to see the wall of patents. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and you probably guessed it by now, but another pantry. This one's a lot greener than the rest. The Razor bathroom. RGB. So the Razor building itself is six floors high, and Razor only takes the first five floors. So we went to see what's on the sixth floor. 
So now we're going to the real reason why we came here. It was actually not for Razor and it was actually Mihoyo's main office. How sad is that? <laughs> So yes, it's actually the Hoyoverse office and if you didn't know, Hoyoverse is responsible for another small IP called uh, Genshin Impact if you haven't heard of it. And after stealing some Primal Gems, we actually went down to a nearby building to eat lunch. Thanks for the meal. Welcome. <laughs> Alright, yeah, so this is the end of the Razer HQ tour. Thank you guys so much for letting me be here. I mean, it's honestly an honor to come to the Razer HQ of Singapore. And uh, yeah, thanks for the tour. And that's pretty much it for the vlog. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you all next time. Thanks, guys.